Celebrations on the streets of Niger. These activists are celebrating the news that their country, along with Burkina Faso and Mali, has exited ECOWAS. We're free from ECOWAS, this demonstrator says, to hell with their sanctions. This young man says the citizens are fighting to show ECOWAS what they're capable of. On Sunday, Niger, Mali and Burkina Faso announced they were leaving the economic community of West African states effective immediately. A military spokesperson for Niger explained the three countries believe the bloc has drifted too far from its founding principles. The organization notably failed to assist these states in their existential fight against terrorism and insecurity. Worse, when these states decided to take their destiny into their own hands, ECOWAS allegedly adopted an irrational and unacceptable stance by imposing sanctions that were illegal, illegitimate, inhuman and irresponsible. One thing they have in common, all three are run by the military since a string of coups in recent years. It puts them at odds with the rest of West Africa, which has been urging them to return to democracy. ECOWAS once a shut in typically 12 months uh, process. Many of the military regimes are asking for more time, for three years, or some are even uh, not even committing to any particular period of time. Africa analysts say this is uncharted territory. This is a moment in history where either the region gets better or things go, go worse in terms of economic and poverty situation, but also security challenges. So this obviously is going to have a, an economic impact you know, number one you know in how to get your export uh, imports to their imports and exports to their countries and also it's going to affect you know the movement of uh, people from these three countries you know across the other remaining uh, 12 countries of ECOWAS. ECOWAS protocol dictates a 12-month withdrawal period for departing nations. But given the bloc has been unable to encourage the military rulers to return to democracy, it may not have the power to enforce that rule either.